can yeah i want a bloody competition like this is crazy i love it i do hi everyone and welcome back to another video i've just received a in the star parcel to be honest i have never ordered from in the star and if you don't know what in star in the star is this is not sponsored by them by the way okay it's not sponsored but it is like a clothing range and i think i think they do a lot of collaborations with like influence influencers and things like that last week one of my friends um entered both of us into like an in the star competition it's one of them you know when you enter a competition you never think that you're going to win anything but anyway so we entered a competition we one so i had a little bit of a money i got a money voucher and i thought to myself i'm just gonna have a bit of a bruise and i never order from there so i have no idea but i picked two items for the amount that i that i picked now i'm not gonna lie i have already opened the parcel because i've done like a bit of a, sh a video like a short video that i'm gonna put on my instagram probably on here as well if you if you want to follow me on instagram then my link um in the description will be in the description below oh my god this is bad um i haven't long finished work and uh, uh, this is the the aftermath of a long day you don't even know what day i've bloody had so the parcel has come like this well it didn't come like this but this is what you're gonna see it as so i've already opened it and um, but it just comes in a in style bag and what i've ordered is a pair of trainers so it comes in this box how are you by the way how are you um let me know in the comments down below i've got some trainers and i've got some white ones because i thought well i don't know i just fancied to get in some trainers to be honest because it's just one of them i might save these for like spring next year you know when it's not in the winter anymore because i'm wearing boots and things like that but anyway so i've got some of these white trainers now i'm, I'm gonna be honest i ain't really want to wear trainers like this I'll change in one then. Nice and basic and white. Um, so I think if I can, I'll link what I've got in the description below. Um, if you want to go and check them out. But I've got these trainers. I mean, you can't believe it, can you? I won a bloody competition. Like, this is crazy. I love it. I do. They're nice and basic. I really like them. Just pure white. Really easy. Like, when you just want to chuck on now. Again, I ain't really. I wear slip-on trainers. Um, but I never wear trainers like this. So this is something else for me, this. I feel like I'm going to go to the gym or something. And that happening. So I picked up these trainers. What do you think? I mean, even if, even if you're not into trainers, I think they're not bad. Um, I like how it's just like a bit of a different shade there to everything else. I think I've got a hair on me. So that was one purchase that I made. I also got... Now, I feel like I need to go at one size down on this. But it is very much... It's a Jack Jossa jacket. Well, it, she was the one advertising it anyway. Um, it's the colour nude. It's called, yeah, it's the Jacka Jossa Herringbone Belted Shacket. Um, it's this. So it's just like, that's the material, you know. This is all it, the bits and bobs, you know. And it's got like a belt. What I'll do, let me just put it on for you. Let me, shall I put it on for you? I feel like, do I need to size down? Do I need to size down? I don't know. Let me try it on. Right, so let's have a look. So, this is it. It is a little bit, it's, you know, it's a bit over. I don't know what there is, but uh, I think it's if you need to send it back. But it's this. I don't know. I think it's like, I think it's meant to be, like, oversized. If I do this, I do this. I think the arms, I mean, you know, I've got this belt here. I'm going to stand up. Well, I've got this belt. You know what we're saying. But I don't normally do try on to do I don't normally do things like this, but I think it's quite cool. I've got a white t shirt on on underneath, bit of a gold chain. I don't know I don't know who I think I am. But this is it with the belt there. With some boots or something, all them trainers. I mean, it's beautiful, but I just feel like if I was to size Darren um would it then be you know i can't wear things underneath i think it's all right you know i think it is nice i'm gonna keep it because i want it anyway so it's like, like i mean any situation where it's cost me anything but oh god oh god that's the situation anyway I was very lucky because you know things like this cost a lot of money 
and it's high now joke so i'm very very lucky that i've managed to pick those things up let me just put my jacket my cardigan back on so anyway i thought i thought like, oh, this is coming down god this is ridiculous so i just wanted to film that to be honest because i want i want my tea but in this video after showing you that right um i don't know what else to update you on really i've been update i've been um sorting out my cupboards like my christmas decorations and i've got this bag here this bag it's full of like things to take to the charity shop um so if you live near me you're gonna have a field day but i've been sorting out my christmas stuff and i'm just thinking just get these i don't need that i've been doing that right my brother's ringing me i'm gonna sort him out right i've sorted him out now i've sorted him out actually whilst i'm on this kind of agenda uh showing you some stuff i want to show you a jacket i'm getting jackets here there and everywhere i picked up a goat a coat from tesco that's been brilliant i picked this up but I've, it's nice that i've got one for different events anyway i picked up a jacket from the charity shop let me bloody show you it's this it's this jacket right this lighting ain't gonna be very good on this i don't think it's shocking it's shocking and gone I'm going to just change that light in a second. This side, this side, good. But anyway, I've got this, this jacket, right? This is the colour. I'm trying to change the... It's, um... Oh, you're just going to have, you're just going to have to accept what it is. But it's this jacket, right? And it's like a blazer type jacket. And that's the back, right? And I got it from Acorns. It was originally from uh, TU, which is like, you know, Sainsbury's. Etena brand new jacket and i can imagine this i'm gonna try it on for you i'm gonna try it on i might as well i've tried everything else i tried it on in the shop in, in the charity shop and it was stunning you know when you try some at on i feel like i've got a bit of I, i'm experimenting with a bit of the fashion i'm just gonna put this on this is the jacket right this is the jacket got the top i doing very justice is it this is like good let's put my hair done properly but look at this. I'm gonna sec. How can I put it down a bit? It fits a bit better than the other one. But um, you just wrap it over with your. Oh god, oh god, this how good is it? This is so nice. Honestly, this is this is nice. Look at this. It's like a smart, a smart attire. The lighting is not doing it justice. So I probably will go out some one of the days. In fact, on Sunday. There is um, like a garden centre which is very local to us and oh my goodness, when I tell you I've never known it but it's got a really good event going on on Sunday, it's Saturday and Sunday actually, so I'm thinking I might wear this on Sunday, yeah? My tea's ready, I better go, but yeah this is, uh, I'm going to show you better on Sunday I think because the lighting will be better. But I'm finding some right bargains at the, the charity shop, so I am. And I'm finding, well, that's inside with a bit of black. I'm just finding that I just want to jazz up my outfits a bit, even if it's with just one staple piece, which is a coat. Like, I, I feel ready. Let me let me escape. It's Sunday now, and we're getting ready. We're getting ready to go out. Chris is upstairs. I'm in the kitchen already, as usual. But this is the jacket. I thought um, I'd show you. Um, even a daylight because you know it's just it was just too dark the other night oh glad i got this it's just so lovely anyway so i'm wearing this and then i've just dug out another bag um ate my little bag my little bag box thing that i've got in the cupboard i do love crossbody bags but this is in my cupboard so i'm just gonna wear this take it out for a bit of a spin it's just like kind of like you know i don't know i'm just gonna wear what i want to wear let's just enjoy our little sunday out and um, i need to take some parcels as well Hold up, I am on my way, I'm in motion Let's go to the ocean Yeah, let's go outside We can hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas time We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Doesn't matter if the snow is falling Or the windows in the rain is... Oh, yes, please. 
please. Fruit of Madeira or chocolate. Ooh, I'm gonna go for the, is that chocolate, yeah? Double chocolate white. Oh, nice. And that's lemon Madeira, that's lovely. Is it? And the fruitcake is delicious. But if he's not eating, you should have that one. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Christmas in my heart But this year I wanna hang out with my friends and family Making angels in the sand you at me Doesn't matter, it is Christmas in my heart And I can promise Santa's coming to visit No, he wouldn't miss this in Christmas times center uh, this is the one that we went to if you are local to me or in the west midland area and you just want to kind of know where i've been i've been to here but this one is a lot more local to me and we've never been like i said and i saw it advertised we had 20 percent off the christmas decorations and it was just like a whole it was just a wholesome lovely vibe in there we went in the restaurant i had a cup of tea and a little cake that i did want like a festive christmas bath that they had like, with a bit of turkey cranberry sauce and stuff in but they had none left i think we were just a little bit too late to go in there but it was so, it was nice and i'll definitely be going back there again especially in the summer when we want like some new plants or something for the garden it was just it was just so nice got a few little bits some for me um some maybe a couple of bits for the for christmas i'm not sure quite sure but we didn't get a lot but i thought well to conclude this video you want to know what i picked up from there the home is on full steam for christmas in our house i don't start like festive decorating until at least the beginning of december i'm not an early bird for christmas decorating i've just got over halloween and i just kind of like that little break um i don't like to jump into it straight away so um let's just see what i'll picked up in the garden centre so i've never brought myself an expensive calendar but as you can see in the far corner i do have a calendar in the kitchen i have done for years to be fair i kind of like it i like to jot on there um, birthdays and celebrations or you know when the bills are next year that kind of thing but i've treated myself um which chris did encourage me to an Emma Bridgewater 2024 calendar well they've called it a planner month to month two column view and in the garden center they had a lovely range of emma water emma, emma bridgewater products now whenever i brought something emma bridgewater they've come from the charity shop however how lovely is this it was 6.99 but i think this would be really lovely if um, you wanted to gift it someone for christmas but this one was a gift to me they had these little trays now they had the mugs is that the right way they had the mugs no this is the right way and like i said they had the mugs in there that are very standard you know they're everywhere and then i was like oh i don't really fancy spending 25 quid on a mug i didn't really need it to be fair because you never know i might find one in the charity shops one day but um this was a little christmas tray um i love the design and it was 4.99 and it that was kind of in my budget um so 4.99 christmas biscuits is the range ever breed water i thought that was really cute so i'm just going to pop this in my christmas box but i was tempted to just put it out but i'm not i'm going to put it straight in my christmas box that i've been organizing and that's going to fit straight in there ready for december then i got some um tissue paper I have four sheets of metallic tissue paper. I just wanted them just for like my vintage orders. The next little thing, which was so cute, 
he was so so cute and i think you can probably get these in a lot of garden centers but these are the um little dog lead hooks um so this one says monty's name so a spoilt rotten dog called monty lives here and uh yeah you just put the lead on there how oh, lovely is that so i picked that up as well in fact chris saw that and he was like we're gonna have to get it so that's why we got it we've got this um it's called magic spells incense sticks um protection black opium and it's got this little wooden little thing on there that's like a christmas present so we picked that up and then our ball balls for this year because every year I mean, it's going to have to stop at one point, um, but every year we kind of just pick one ball ball each and we go to a garden centre and we got these. So this is Christmas, Christy's choice. Um, so it just says Merry Christmas. If it's going to focus, is it going to focus? It says Merry Christmas. It's getting quite dark now, to be fair. Merry Christmas uh, with the candy canes. And then I picked this one up because it was just so like not Christmassy, but I did like it uh it's like this pattern like that'd be really nice on like a handbag um, and it kind of matches my jacket that was everything that we picked up from the garden center today and then of course we went to the cafe restaurant and had something to eat so i really enjoyed today it was just something that i really needed because i haven't felt great mentally over the last few days you know when you just life just gets on top of you sometimes so i think it was just really nice to get out put my new jacket on get dressed up a little bit and just enjoy the day and um, but thank you very much for watching if you stuck till the end i will see you in my next video whenever that may be i hope you're all, all good if you like this video please like it down below and subscribe if you are not already subscribed it would really really help my channel i will see you in my next video guys thanks so much for watching again take care bye